This is Quilt. It's both a multi-band filter and a delay. Both the filter and the delay are controlled by tempo. Connect any audio input and set the way you want it to be filtered. Quilt is great for making a rhythmic sound galactic. or for giving character and movement to a constant sound like this. Entire songs sound great too. Now that we know how the patch sounds, we'll talk briefly about how it works. The audio comes into the patch, then it gets filtered in various patterns. The individual frequency bands get delayed, then sent to the audio output. The filter and the delay can be synced using a global tempo. We can set filter time independent of the delay time and make unique syncopated rhythms. The keyboard controls which frequency bands are active and therefore able to be controlled by the pattern you've selected. Here they are all on, but we can toggle them off to narrow down the overall frequency ranges. We can quickly turn them all back on with the aux menu command. Use the aux menu to navigate between the pages in this patch and to start or stop the pattern. Since the filter and delay both sync to tempo, let's start with that setting. You can manually dial up the tempo on the tempo page, or if you send quilt an external MIDI clock, the patch will sync to that. On the BPM page, set controls for your synced filtering and delay. Now let's make a new pattern. On the pattern page, choose the frequency bands you want to be heard. Set the pattern play direction, note subdivision, and note duration. For example, here we have six bands playing with an up-down pattern at 16th notes, and each note lasts the duration of three 16th notes. In the filter page, set the resonance, dry-wet amount, noise amount, and the duration of the notes in the pattern. The noise mix is a cool feature, because it's like a synthesizer that has a noise oscillator that you can just turn up. But this is an audio effect. Add a noise oscillator to any instrument. Use the delay page in a similar way to the pattern page. Choose the rhythmic note of your desired delay time and the number of notes of your delay time.
set the feed back and dry wet them out. Here we have an eighth note delay that happens every seven eighth notes. Thank you. 